Hey, little quick addition. Uh, the throttle assembly showed up today, just a little bit ago in the mail. So, um, according to the seller I bought it from on eBay, it came off of a 98 cyclone, fuel cyclone. And it has a single single cable instead of a double, instead of a push pull. But you can see, works just fine. Snaps right back. I already put the old Vans grip on it. So I think, um, I couldn't find any, uh, couldn't find OEM pistons for this caliper. They're not available. So I'm going to have to just buy another used caliper off of eBay. Keep it moving. I was trying to find that caliper that came off of the old water-cooled 1100. Maybe it had the same size pistons in it, but I must have threw it away already. I don't know. I didn't think I did. But I might have. Anyway, we'll uh, we'll get on eBay. I already got one saved. I just got to order it. I gotta wait a few days, get my money back up a little bit. But you guys can understand that, right? Um, I gotta buy a switch also to mount on this handlebar. Looks like I've got enough room to put a switch to replace this with a, a, a little toggle and a push button for my starter button. I mean, I could put the old push button down on the starter itself, but I'd prefer to have it up here. Um, and then a tether, so they'll both fit in there. So I got a few more pieces I gotta buy. Get that stuff all wrapped up, get some uh, aluminum and mount that fairing back on it. And then I will probably take her for a ride down the road before I tear into the back end just to make sure I don't have any head shake or anything to where I might have to uh, get a steering stable. Well, you know that tire, it's probably going to shake anyway with that cupped out tire. So that's not a real fair assessment. A scratch out idea i guess but anyway um thanks to um marshall and uh norman both commented told me to look for the tube frame buell parts appreciate it you guys that helped out a bunch that was i paid a little bit more for this than i wanted to with the throttle and the cable i think it was shipped to my door $67 but hey working is working and I didn't have to pay $180 for a new Makuni throttle so or however much they're charging for them now they're pretty ridiculous there it is we're gaining on it man we're gaining on it like I said I get me a new caliper get that switch MPS switch housing and a tether kill get put on this and that will then I can bleed the brakes and call this front end done. So that's it for now. Uh, thanks for watching, guys. Don't forget to hit that like button. And please consider subscribing. Thanks. Have a good one.